భజగోవిందం వర్స్ టూ కంటెంట్మెంట్ విత్ వాట్ యు డిరైవ్ ఫ్రమ్ ఆనెస్ట్ యాక్షన్ మూఢీ ధనాగమ తృష్ణ కురు సద్బుద్ధి మనసి వితృష్ణ ఎల్లభసే నిజ కర్మోపాతం విత్తం తేన వినోదయ చిత్తం భజగోవిందం భజగోవిందం గోవిందం భజ మూఢమతే ఓ ఫూలిష్ వన్ గివ్ అప్ ద ప్యాషన్ టు పొసెస్ వెల్త్ అండ్ అండర్స్టాండ్ ద రియాలిటీ బీ కంటెంట్ విత్ వాట్ యు గెట్ త్రూ యువర్ హానెస్ట్ యాక్షన్స్ సీక్ గోవింద సీక్ గోవింద a story based on this verse there is a story about how a monkey catcher catches the monkeys a monkey catcher saw a lot of monkeys on a tree and came up with an idea of how to catch them he got a lot of peanuts and stored them in a long but narrow necked jar and left it below the tree the monkeys were watching this monkeys love peanuts and were waiting for the monkey catcher to leave as soon as he left a monkey jumped down and slipped its hand through the mouth of the jar to grab the peanuts it was happy to have so many in its hand and quickly tried to pull up its hand to eat the peanuts try as much it may it couldn't pull its hand out the hand got stuck in the narrow neck of the jar the monkey was so attached to the peanuts that having closed them in its fist it was refusing to let go of them as a result of this it couldn't move its hands from the jar it got stuck and soon the monkey catcher came happily and took the monkey away if only the monkey had let go of the peanuts it would have escaped but the attachment and greed to the peanuts did not allow it to do that and as a result it got stuck and ultimately became miserable having been caught in the hands of the monkey catcher so adi shankara tells us to bring understanding and awareness in our lives to develop love and will for detachment one can earn money which is very essential but earn it with honest means be contented with what we earn this way one should give up the delusion illusion and attachment towards wealth the more we are attached and refuse to let go we will be caught in the trap like the monkey it is said there is enough for everyone's need but not enough for everyone's greed greed makes one earn through wrong means and not parting our wealth to help the needy when money is earned out of love honesty sincerity it's more fulfilling so shankara exhorts o oh foolish mind develop the sense of detachment and live through honest means and seek govinda this is not only true for money but for relationships as well parents are so attached to their children that many a times they stifle the growth and progress of their very own child whom they love attachment blinds them once the child has grown up parents should learn to let go of them but always love them and be supportive and encouraging whenever needed then there will be good relationship between the parents and the child both will have a sense of mutual respect and love rather than being burdened by too much love and possession now let's listen to a story for the students ramchand and premchand were neighbors ramchand was a poor farmer Premchand was a landlord. Ramchand used to be very relaxed and happy. He never bothered to close the doors and windows of his house at night. He had deep sound sleeps. Although he had no money, he was peaceful. Premchand used to be tense always. He was very keen to close the doors and windows of his house at night. He could not sleep well. He was always bothered that someone might break open his safes and steal away his money. he envied the peaceful ramchand one day 
Premchand called Ramchand and gave him a box full of cash saying, Look my dear friend, I am blessed with plenty of wealth. I find you in poverty. So take this cash and live in prosperity. Ramchand was overwhelmingly happy. He was joyful throughout the day. Night came. Ramchand went to bed as usual. But today, he could not sleep. He went and closed the doors and windows. He still could not sleep. He began to keep on looking at the box of cash. The whole night he was disturbed. As soon as the day dawned, Ramchand took the box of cash to Premchand. He gave away the box to Premchand saying, Dear friend, I am poor, but your money took away my peace from me. Please bear with me and take back your money. Money cannot get everything. Work hard and do your best to gain in material life. But realize that money is not everything. Students should develop the qualities of honesty and hard work. They should do their best and hope for the best. Some things are not in our control and despite our best efforts, we may not get the results we expect. If we keep holding on to such situations which we cannot help, it will only lead us to unhappiness. We have to learn to let go and then we have sense of freedom and mind will be open to receive other things which may be very good for us. For example, in case of children who are possessive of their sweets, toys, gadgets, etc., they keep holding on to it without sharing with others. Such children will not be able to receive anything new unless they free their hands of their possession. Similarly, greed can blind us from being concerned for others. We keep storing our things and the process we lose relationships and our happiness. Jai Sairam.